Today we are going to check out Bao Li Xuan Chinese restaurant, which is the only fine dining Chinese restaurant in all of the Bulgari hotels in the world. And this one is situated in the Bulgari Hotel in Shanghai. It is located on the third floor of the historic Chamber of Commerce, Shanghai, and it serves Cantonese fine cuisine, along with some signature dishes from Shanghai and Hangzhou. Decor is quite contemporary and elegant, with some black lacquer panels and Art Deco patterned carpets. With custom-made Italian chairs, artistic lighting. They also have six private dining rooms. Each are decorated in their own color of silk wallpaper. You'll also see some Bulgari jewelry sketches. I did notice they have an English menu on their website, so they probably have that in the restaurant as well if you ask for it. As for the price, this is a very high-end and pretty expensive restaurant for Shanghai standard. But if you come for lunch for dim sum, it's more affordable, between nine to eighteen U.S. dollars per dim sum. We made a reservation via email, and they responded within two hours, so we thought that was quite efficient. When we got there, the restaurant was pretty empty, but we did enjoy the privacy and serenity. The chef of this restaurant used to work for the Ritz Carlton Hotel in Macau. The service was phenomenal. Everyone was super friendly, knowledgeable, and nice. Maybe a little bit too over attentive for some people's tastes. I think they poured tea for us for around 30 times during our meal, and there were about four to five different waiters serving us. They gave us some XO sauce on the left side, spicy sauce in the middle, and soy sauce on the right. Since it is oat cuisine, it also has a Chinese version of a mousse bouche. This is the fish marinated in black vinegar. It's pretty crunchy and tasty, and I like the texture because it's not too hard. Next, we had the mixed vegetable steamed dumplings. I love the skin on the outside; it's quite chewy, not too thick, and it goes really well with the exo sauce. And enjoy the crunchiness of the different types of vegetables. This is the steamed turnip cake with Chinese sausage with a little bit of soup. We thought it was really smooth and soft because usually turnip cakes are fried, but this one has a little twist. Next, we had the steamed vegetables with truffles rice noodle roll. Rice noodle rolls are definitely one of the favorites when we order dim sum, and what we usually look for is very thin skin. The skin has to be really soft and smooth, and this one has all of that. The truffle taste is quite light, however, it is significant. So far, everything is pretty good. We also noticed that they already changed our plates a few times. We were impressed by their service, and we did enjoy the pampering. The next dim sum I thought was quite special. It was the abalone puff pastry. The abalone is cooked perfectly, very well seasoned. The pastry was really fragrant, and when you bite into it, it breaks into a million flaky pieces, which was really fun to eat. Actually, this dim sum was too big for one mouthful. So you have to eat the abalone first, and the stuffing underneath was also really tasty, and it goes really well with. The pastry, it's nice and hot. By this time, we had already finished all the exo sauce. 
And the waiter noticed that we finished our sauce. He immediately refilled it for us, and he gave us an extra large portion. Usually, in some restaurants, they would charge you for the extra EXO sauce because it is kind of expensive. And this is the fried vegetarian goose, but it's got no goose in it. It's just the name. And it goes really, really well with the Worcestershire sauce. As for dessert, we had the almond mochi with super gooey mochi and nuts on the outside, with a warm almond paste oozing on the inside. Really, really good as well. As for the petit four, we had the heart-shaped mango treat and cashew cookies, both great. And some Chinese tea to end the meal with a little, very delicate froggy on the side. The bill was around fifty U.S. dollars per person. For this price, we got amazing service, really good food, and super comfortable and tranquil ambiance. I think it's totally worth it. If you like this video, please give us a like and subscribe to our channel. Thank you.